What's cracking, peeps? Welcome back to Hello Neighbor. Now, you guys wanted me to try some stuff without cheats, and I understand that cheats kind of wreck the experience. So, there have been some people doing four item challenge, or doing a four item challenge. I spit in their faces. Bah! Bonus tank does not condone spitting in the faces. Actually, I think it was only Niflick that did a four item challenge, but we're going to try a three item challenge, which is we only can pick up three items. We can put one down, we can put them down, but we can't pick another item back up to replace it. So we're only allowed to ever pick up three items. Now, I do have a plan with this. I'm not sure if it's going to work, but let's try. The first part of my plan is to go over to the trash can here and start teabagging it like so. Oh! Holy shit, that worked first time. <laughs> okay, now the next step is to jump up here, like like so, and grab this crowbar. There's my one item, and that's one of the items I need to sneak into the basement or to uh, take the boards off the basement door. So the next step is to go down here, and then we get the key card. I'm stuck here. I'm, I'm stuck. No, we're good. We're good. So we pick up the key card. The neighbor must be nearby. Okay, next up, our third and final item will be the basketball. The almighty basketball. Once we basket this ball, we can't pick it up ever again. So how do I throw it like this? Hoo-ya! Okay, now we, now we want to jump out the window. And we want to sneak around the side here. Ah! Oh, what the fuck did you come from? Okay, well at least I got my, my two items. But I don't know how I'm going to get in now. I can't make a lot of noise. So that part of the plan failed. I do have my two items that I need though. I just don't know how to go about this. I can't pick up any more items. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where is he? He's looking at me. You stay away from me, man. You stay away. So how are we gonna do this? I can't make noise with an item. I guess that's just, let's just sneak in here. Where is he? I don't even see him. Okay, he's there. He's there. Oh, he's jumping up. Now I can jump through your window, man. Thanks for that. Thank you so much for that. So we're going to go stand over here. He's going to go do his thing. Where are you going to go, man? I know you see me. I know you see me, but you can't do anything because I'm on my porch. This is my property. Let's sneak on. We'll sneak through his window. Okay, so we'll beep this. And we'll press one. And we're done. Open it up, actually. There we did. We did it. Ha ha. We did the three item challenge. We have succeeded. Unless he catches us now, but he's not going to catch us. Where am I? I'm stuck. There's like a weird ass door here. Never noticed that. So then we're done here. We're down here. We can live in the basement for all eternity. For all eternity. We did it. Let's just complete the game now. There we go. Three item challenge. I have completed it. It's, it's a pretty hard challenge, possibly. If you didn't get on the roof the first time, it would have been hard because you can't pick up the trash can to place it down properly. So that was that was luck on my part, and I believe that's how the speedrunners do it. They do that, but they do it a lot quicker than me. So let's see if I can do it a little faster this time. I'm not going to cut any of it from the the video. It's just going to be one full length, assuming I can do it. So we're going to restart the level so we get a, a full on go, and then we set a clock here, and then I got to start this. Okay, so we want to want to teabag about here. Where am I? Damn it! <laughs> It didn't work, and the car almost hit me. Take two's got to work, right? Take two's got to work. Whap! Keep, keep, just, just teabag until it works. Just teabag until it works, please. What? Okay, where am I? That's the wrong way. Damn it, garbage can. Okay, restart level again, and let's try that one more time. One more time. I'm going to run over here, I'm going to jump up here, and we're going to teabag like so. And it never, it never works the first time ever again. Ever again. That was like the biggest fluke and I can't believe I got it the first time. I want a speed run. Where am I? Damn it. Okay. Come on. Boom. Go. Run over here. We jump. Jump on the trash can. Jump it on it. And then where am I? Um, keep teabagging. Get in the... <laughs> Take 78. Go. What? And then teabag. That is the wrong way. I can't ever get it to work again. 
Is there, is there a certain point I've got to be standing on it? I don't know where I'm supposed to stand on it. Oh, I almost got hit by that car. If there wasn't a boundary there. Let's do that instead. I, th I think we've, we'll do that instead. Apparently, you can get hit by the car. You just have to delete the boundary. So let's do that because I'm not getting this speed run thing down. Maybe next time I will try it if I can somehow work that out. But for now, let's play as only this. So the car freezes, right? The car freezes. And then we want to, we want to unfreeze it. But we want to have it on lock, like so. Okay, I got your car. I got you. So now, if we pull up the uh, console here and we go delete, destroy target, boom. Now, there should be no boundary there and we can get hit by the car. Look at this. And then I unfreeze it and the car hits me. Ah! Okay. Well, now we can delete this wall too. Destroy target. Look at that. I wonder how far the car could take us. How many friggin' walls is there? Okay, so now... We can delete houses, I believe, because we are outside the map. We've deleted the wall outside the map. There's a lot of trenches here. So I can delete this house. Goodbye. So long, you stupid house. <laughs> oh, I like that. Now we can have no houses. Do you want to be here, house? Do you, do you want to be part of this neighborhood? Well, screw you, house. We're, we're cleaning up this neighborhood, and we're going to just we're gonna pave it all, put up a parking lot or something. I'm not sure what's going on here, but we're going to just take away all the houses so that we can do other stuff with. No houses can be in this neighborhood anymore. Look at that. It's a lot cleaner. It's a lot cleaner like this. I don't know what the go is with all the, the roads being like trenches. That's still a worrying one. Oh, there's another car. Let's see if we can get in this one. Okay, so here we are. We're in the car. It doesn't do anything. That was a stupid idea. What the frick? Oh. Oh, I appeared. I fell off the map. That's what you guys have been saying. That the lost and found box, obviously, anything that falls off the map or under the map is too far, you get teleported to the lost and found box. So, like before, if we go and we pick up this lawnmower, like so, pick up the lawnmower, and then increase our size, and here we are. Now, if we delete the uh, the ground like we did before and then we chuck the lawnmower and then when it falls off drop it there and it should there we go look at that now can we like delete the neighbor's house Does, is that a thing delete the neighbor's house destroy target there we go look at all these i holy crap <laughs> it's like a waterfall of of items that is awesome and the neighbor is stuck there there you go man you're getting you're having a a, a shower what is that glowing thing what is that? Is that a lamp or something? I think it's a lamp. It's nothing special. It's just a lamp. This is like the waterfall of terror. This is going to kill the neighbor. Can you grab me? You can't. Can you? Anyway, peeps, I think I'm going to have to end it here. Next time, I may do a speed run if I can work out how to get on the roof uh, more frequently. If you enjoyed and you want to see more, smash that like button. Have a good one and I'll catch you later when we have a floor.